السلام عليكم ويلكم باك تو بارت 3 اوف موديول 1 براكتيكال نيوميريكال ميثودز فور ساينتست اند انجينيرز توداي اور توتوريال اور اور ليسون اون فيكتورز سو ويل ستارت هاو تو كرييت فيكتورز ان ماتلاب سو فيكتورز كان بي كرييتد ان هوريزونتال واي اور فيرتيكال واي سو سبوز ذات يو وانت تو كرييت فيكتورز ذات هاز سيرتن نمبرز 1 2 3 4 سو يو كان بوت ذيس نمبرز um space by a space between two squared brackets so uh, between two brackets you can put the numbers one two three four five then it will be um, assigned here okay also instead of space you can put comma so once you put comma it also do the same so one two three four five it also do the same also if you want to create um uh, vectors that are spaced by one so you can instead of put all numbers you can just use a colon so for example squared column one to five so it's one two three four five if you make a column between one to ten so it will be one two three four five six seven eight nine ten also if you want the increment to be assigned to certain value instead of one you can put this assigned value For example, one to five, but the increment will be two. So one colon two colon five. So it will be one three five. Also, the built-in function in MATLAB is very helpful. Len space is very helpful to create horizontal vectors. So len space, you put the first number and the last number. and the number of vectors Re take care pay attention here we put the increment value of the increment but here's the total number of vectors so i want array from one to five but all of them are three vectors so it will be one three five let's do this the same i want to start from one and the end one is 10 but only three vectors so it will be one uh, five point five the 10 so they are equally spaced so what will happen if you didn't put three the number of uh, vectors it automatically lens space will create 100 points equally spaced points so 100 spaced vectors so 1 2 3 4 4 until you reach 10 so it will be divided until you reach t uh, 10 100 vectors okay uh, now So this is for the assigned vector you want. Suppose that you want random vectors. Okay, you want to create random vectors. So here's random. Random is a uh, um, random function. You can use it. So random, you can use rand between parentheses. Here is the number of column, a number of rows, and here is number of columns. So one is number of rows and Eight is number of columns so you can change these values to choose the whatever you want okay now so if we want to run will create randomly number from 0 to 1 so by using this built-in function the vector I have is between randomly between point 0 to point 1 so different number okay what will happen if I want to make uh, for example I want to choose from 0 to 500 simply multiply this function by 500 so here by 500 I have a uh, vectors from 0 to a uh, number of random vectors from 0 to 500 if you want them integers so use the round before the 500 times run one zero okay suppose that you want to have to choose the random numbers between two values for example from 100 to 500 instead of zero so we have equation nice equation here you have to low plus up minus low times random function so now we want to create uh random five integers from f 100 to 500 
so easy a equal round 100 this is the low plus up minus low so 500 minus uh, 100 then round one five so it will give me randomly five uh five randomly numbers between um 100 and 500 if you repeat this it will be different so uh, let's take an example here in um, in a lot there are uh, three winners must be selected from a ticket that have a numbers from uh, 321 to 515 so do you think MATLAB will help in this? So now we have a ticket from the minimum value is 321 and the maximum is 550 and we want to select three integers only. So as we said, winners equal round minimum or the low number plus maximum minus minimum times round we want only three numbers so one comma three so then the winners will be 502 and 541 and 471 let's try it again so we have another three different another again we have another again so as you uh, every every time you have to, uh, different numbers or different winners also vectors can be created vertically in the MATLAB using different commands similar to uh, horizontal but a little bit different so we can instead of comma or space we can put semicolon so if you put semicolon uh, it will be vertically like like this also you can uh, use same like space if you want to put space you can put space but after uh, uh close the squared bracket just put uh, apostrophe so once you put apostrophe it will be um uh, vertical instead of horizontal like here uh, i want to create from one to ten but the increment will be two and i put apostrophe here so it'll be one three five seven and nine sometimes um you you know you know how to convert from uh, uh, you can convert from vertical to horizontal or from horizontal to vertical for example okay let's see okay for example if you have uh, a equal one two three close the brackets so now you have horizontal if you want to uh, want it to uh, have it vertical so just you can p equal a apostrophe so it will be vertical okay and if you want to create it horizontal again c equal for example p apostrophe so uh, sorry apostrophe so it will be horizontal again but sometimes you want to ensure the array in one way in one format I mean sometimes you want to if the um, if you if the user put the values you want the array to have it in vertical so if the user put the values in vertical so no problem if the if the user put the values in horizontal it will convert the uh, to vertical so here reshape is a good way so reshape x you can put your array here and then the required number of rows and column so if the user put them in different ways so it will he as a matlab will reshape them in the it's very useful when you format sometimes you make uh, uh, create script file it will go will later will describe the things so uh, and you want to do some calculation or some steps with this script file based on special format so you can put this as uh, this um, option or this script uh, as this code as a part of your program to ensure the uh, form correct format of matrix or array for example write a matlab syn uh, syntax that convert x horizontal 
array to vertical one and do nothing for vertical array here's the column will be one and the rows should be any number i don't know any number of arrays okay so the syntax should be reshape x comma two squared brackets and have nothing inside and one so this means any any number of columns any number of uh, uh, sorry number of rows i don't care but make the column one so now i create x from one to five one two three four five and then y equal reshape x whatever the number and one so it will be y one two three in vertical way another use for syntax so i use the column between two parentheses if you uh, x put x and parentheses and column or whatever the uh, here the vector okay uh, the, so between parentheses so it will be convert them to um, vertical way in contrast if you want to convert the vertical way to horizontal way and do nothing for horizontal way so just we'll do reshape x one one is the number of rows required and whatever the number of column so for example we created x one to five apostrophe so this is my x so reshape x one and uh, squared brackets two squared brackets so this will be the y now we will go uh, we will start with matrix in matlab so since you know now how to create vectors it's easy to create matrix similarly so we have different ways a lot of ways to create matrix for example we can create different different rows horizontal rows and then combine them so we have a uh, equal one two three four five b equal two three four uh, two three one four five c equal one zero three two five so i create agent and i put semicolon between them to suppress the echo printing and then my matrix is d it's a and vertically b and then vertical c so it create a b c so this is is this is one way another way simply i can put one two three so this is one row then column uh, semicolon four five six semicolon uh, seven so each semicolon will go for another row like this uh, also we have a specific matrix in matlab so like once once you get one three so it will create all ones or zeros so it will create all zeros so if you create three twos it would make three and uh, three columns and two uh, three uh, rows and two columns also there is some specific called i uh, it's important for some calculation matrix compact uh, so i so it will be only have diagonal ones and all are zero thank you